St. Louis is looking to take the next step to up security in parking lots across the city. And tomorrow, the Board of Aldermen will look to add security measures for privately owned surface lots in order to cut down on car burglaries. For more on this story tonight, First Alert Force Justin Andrews live downtown. And Justin, you talked to drivers who park their cars downtown. What did they have to say about this tonight? Yes, Sam, as you can imagine, they are all for these security upgrades. They say they are sick and tired of their cars getting broken into. And with this legislation, it seems like city leaders are listening. Somebody bust through the window and took all the change and all the money. Orlandis Rohde is one of likely thousands of people in St. Louis who have been victims of car break-ins. It's just all type of stuff going on downtown city area that where you always have to be aware and it, it shouldn't be that way. And city leaders agree. Cars are getting vandalized. Uh, people are getting robbed and abused on these surface parking lots. Alderman Machine Aldred sponsored a bill that would force the owners of paid surface lots in the city to add security measures like fencing, lighting, and cameras that capture all of the cars on the lot. Uh, especially in the downtown area, we have a lot of surface parking lots that have uh, no security measures. Friday, the bill goes before the Board of Aldermen for its second reading. Nick Gerdell knows the dangers of simply parking. His car was broken into, so any extra measures is perfect in his book. I think it'll be more helpful. People will feel a little bit more secure about when they go to events or activities around here. Alderman Aldred says the bill only applies to privately owned lots that charge for parking. Ones that don't charge for parking or is attached to a business are exempt. The bill got no pushback as it moved out of committee, meaning Gerdell and Rody could soon feel safe parking on downtown lots. I feel like it's a good deterrent to have and hopefully it'll help. If this bill continues to pass through as is and the mayor signs it in the next couple of weeks, the city will give these private lot owners a year to do the security upgrades. If they fail, Alderman Aldred says they could lose their surface parking lots license. If we have security, we wouldn't have to look over our shoulders every time just to make sure our belongings and everything that we own are safe. Now, Aldridge says next year they plan to look at garages downtown to see what security upgrades can be made there. We're live downtown tonight. I'm Justin Andrews, First Alert 4. Justin, thank you. Tonight.